Today it's a, a beautiful sunny day in South Bruce Peninsula and we are going to be doing some more cleaning and taking advantage of this really nice weather. The weather is going to change on us in the next few days. It's expected that we're going to have snow, freezing rain, fog. Today we're above five and we're going to take full advantage of that. Stick around and we'll show you how to clean some baffles. The first thing we're going to do is I'm spraying these with an oven cleaner. Just a note, you never want these things to get too dirty. If they are completely covered in layers upon layers of orange grease, not only are they a fire hazard, but they're so much harder to clean. If you ever have a fire inspection, the first, they're going to look at these and say, hey, these should have been cleaned more often. The way that I get around this, because I'm a really busy person, I have two sets of these. So when one set gets dirty after about two and a half weeks, I pull them out, give myself lots of time to clean them when I pop in the nice brand new clean set. All right, to clean our floor mat today while we're waiting for the uh, oven cleaner to work on the baffles, what we've done is we've just taken a couple of two by fours, put some screws into it, and we've hung our cow mats up on top of it so we can power wash those. Better to multitask and not waste our time. And you'll find that some restaurants will clean these. I've even seen them run through the dishwasher and that's just plain gross. <laughs> so we do ours yeah. outside and we're gonna get them nice and clean. I clean these a couple times a year and then I clean under the floor every single day. If you have arthritis, these are the best things for your floor. They, they save your back. So I always recommend having these mats in your kitchen. I, I know my knees improve greatly. Yeah. <laughs> Standing so, all day. But they're also a pain to clean, but this is one way to do it where it's nice and easy. In our next video, Anne's going to teach us the art of the perfect French fry. Make sure you like us. Make sure you subscribe. We'll see you next time. See you later.